All right, so I got the belt tensioning mechanism done. And the way it looks like from back here is you pull this down and it tightens that belt tensioner over there. I'll give you a close up of the tensioner right there. So as I tighten it, it pulls it up. As I loosen it, it drops down. I'll follow along. So I just have a link like this and then I bent it. And I'll show you around here. This is what it looks like. There's the rod that goes to another pivot that goes up and down. And I have a little stop right there, there. So it doesn't go back anymore. And then when I tighten it, it comes down and I wanna get it past the center so that it starts to pull. There we go. I'm going to have to hold my phone with the other hand. And I have an adjustable nut here. So as you can see, the line of the rod is just a little bit below the center of this. Because right about here is where it's going to want to flip back. And so I can adjust with this nut that can bring it down or up a little bit more. And the handle is a little bit too long right now. I made it two feet long. And uh, this is plenty long and now that I've actually finished it um, I realized that the material I used is way overkill so this is three quarter inch right here and this here is a three eighths of an inch with a three quarter inch hole and uh, the rod here is a three eighths by three quarters and even this stuff here is uh, way overkill so this is definitely never going to bend but I'd rather do it once and I do it right never have to touch it again so I'm very happy with the way that it works and I tried it with the engine running and it's perfect so for those that gave me the uh, the advice to have some sort of a shield around it because the belt ca kept catching even though it was loose so I made the shield around it and that is perfect so when I tighten it you can see there's the belt doesn't touch anywhere. There's a good, probably three eighths of an inch gap around it. And uh, I think this is gonna work. So thank you to those who helped me out with this. I'm glad this is done. Now I can move on to the next thing.